Hello YouTubers, Doom143 back at it again with another contest entry. Uh, yeah, I was busy today. <laughs> this contest entry is for Amazing Murphinator 1028, his 420 subs 430, <laughs> 430 subscriber contest. A uh, milestone that I can only hope to achieve one day, man. That is really awesome. Congratulations. I mean, great YouTuber, great guy. Um, I'm pretty sure if you're sub to me, you're probably sub to him. It probably should be the other way around. <laughs> but yeah, definitely. If uh, you're sub to me, I'm sure you're sub to him. Great guy, great video. Um, one thing I like about uh, Murphinator is that uh, he's easy to listen to. And that's some, that's the kind of YouTubers I like. People that are very easy to listen to. They draw you in with their conversations. Uh, I can hope to only achieve that goal one day. Um, so yeah, he has a 430 subscriber contest. Pretty easy. Um, he just wants to show off, wants you to show off anything that you got um, signed by an artist a writer anything that you had drawn out anything that you had sketched on comics or whatever's and uh so yeah so i would love to do that contest uh thank you for allowing me to participate and um yeah let's just get into it so um let's start off with some of the prints that i had done uh matt nostos so i think it's matt nostos um did perry the platypus the creator of phineas and Ferb. I did that for my son um really cool guy uh everybody was actually really 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 cool if i can remember correctly the only person i really didn't care for was um rob liefeld but that's, that's not what this video is about uh george perez he did my thanos with the shaka um something that i keep on all my videos um i don't know to me it's just a cool little reminder for everyone that you know I'm from Hawaii and um, you know there's a collector out here too <laughs> don't forget about us Hawaii guys there's a couple of us out here um, but yeah so he's giving um, his hush uh, his hush set away from uh, 608 to 619 and I think he's throwing in another 619 so really cool um, so I figure you know this would be very fitting to show my hush set that I got signed by Scott Williams. He actually signed the whole thing, all 608 to 619, uh, no problem, didn't ask for anything. So I think my wife just gave him like a couple, uh, like a small bento or something just to say thank you. Um, for you guys that don't know bento, that's Japanese for like box lunch. Anyway, that's besides the point. So Batman uh, 608, I'm just showing some of my favorite covers. He signed that one right there on the bottom. Nice guy. Uh, 612, one of my more favorite covers. Again, signing on the bottom right there. 615. 616. Love this cover. Love, 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 love this cover. Sick. Sign it right there. I like how he used the silver pen, knowing that most of these hush books were going to be a little dark. And of course, 619. Uh, second print. Really cool. Um, some other great people that I've met. Uh, one of the awesome guys that I've met is uh, Chris Claremont. Uh, he was nice enough to sign my New Mutants um, Marvel Graphic Novels number four. Um, this first print, I think this is the first appearance of the New Mutants. Uh, yeah, I uh, read it on the inside. Pretty cool book. This is actually a graphic novel, so it's a lot larger than your comic size. Um, he also signed my uh, Avengers Annual number 10, First Appearance of Rogue. Signed it right over there. Yeah, this guy's really cool, man. He'll take the time to talk to everybody. Um, and then he signed my X-Men 201, First Appearance of Baby Cable. Signed it right over there. Also done by Claremont. Um, I've had stuff done by Aunt Lucia. Lucia. Right here. So Ant was uh, nice enough to sign that right there. I love his I love his stuff man like I love his drawings like I don't know why I don't pick up more of his stuff but oh, I don't know why he doesn't have more like crazy variants and stuff um met Ron Lim he signed some stuff for me 
Uh, Secret Defenders. Uh, let me see. Put this back. Secret Defenders number 16. Uh, he signed that one for me right there. He signed uh, Infinity Gauntlet number 6 right there. Infinity Gauntlet number 5 right there. And Infinity War number 1. I just uh, gave him basically anything that I knew that he worked on and whatever I had in my collection. Um, who else did I meet? I met Jeff Loeb. Jeff, sorry, not Jeff Loeb. Jeff Latour. Jason Latour. Right here. This is actually the only guy I know that his insignia as an artist, like right here, is the same as his signature. I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of hard, kind of dark. But yeah, usually um, people will have a different signature. Actually, Bagley's another one too that he kind of does the same thing. So this one is done by Bagley. This one he signed it out to my son Brady. Um, so yeah, I'm a huge Deadpool fan. Um, I like Hulk as well. And yes, my son is named Brady. <laughs> you can you can guess where he got his name from. Go Pats. Um, all right, George Perez. Speaking of George Perez, had him sign a um, couple of my stuff. Infinity Crisis, um, not sorry, not Infinity Crisis. Uh, Crisis number seven, George Perez. If you ever see anybody carrying a dead body like that, more than likely, George Perez. Um, sign my Avengers 181, uh, first Scott Lang, Ant-Man. And my Infinity Gauntlet. See that? <laughs> also signed by George Perez. Really cool guy, man. His lines get really long. And the reason they get really long is because he takes the time to talk to everybody. Really cool guy, man. Um, met Fabian Nietzscheiza. I don't know if I did this one already, but if I didn't, there you go. Circle Chase. Really cool guy. Um, everybody talks about Deadpool and they go straight to Rob Liefeld, but you can't forget he was one of the guys too. So Fabian Nicieza, he's one of the guys that definitely uh, helped to create Deadpool. Um, speaking of Deadpool, I actually had this little figurine signed by George Perez there and Rob Liefeld right, right over there. Um, the reason I had them both sign this is, of course, Rob Liefeld, one of the creators of Deadpool, and George Perez, the creator of Taskmaster. So, yeah, had both of them sign this big little action figure thing. I don't have too much action figures, but I definitely had to pick that one up. And we can't talk about art or comics and signatures without talking about the man Stan Lee. So I had him sign my Spider-Man 300. Had him sign my Hulk 181. There you go. Had him sign it right there. Really nice guy. You only get to meet him for about five seconds, but still, yeah, really nice guy. Um, and my Fantastic Four number 52. Signed it right there. I just got this back from CGC. There is unicorn bukkake all over this thing, man. I don't know if I can show it. I mean, that's not what the video is for, but there is definitely unicorn bukkake all over this thing. And um, one of my more favorite books. This one is signed by Fabian Nietzscheza and Rob Liefeld, New Mutants 98. And um, I actually have one more thing. This is actually from a local artist. You might not know him, but his name is Kevin Sano. Um, I actually should probably should have done this earlier, but there you go. Can't really see it, but this is an art that he did for me. It's Spider-Man and Deadpool. And yeah, he did this for me. He drew it out for me. Um, I don't know where his signature is, right over there. But yeah, he did this for me, colored it, everything. Definitely one of my prized art pieces, even though it's not from somebody that we might not know in the community. This guy in Hawaii is sick. I mean, look at that. Look at that detail. Really awesome. And uh, that's it. So, Murphinator, thank you. Murphinator1028, thank you for having this contest. 
And uh, thank you for allowing me to enter your contest. All right, guys, everybody, shoot.